Hey there, Adam here. Today I'm going to quickly and efficiently show you how to add images to a gallery view database. So again, this needs to be done inside of a database, just like most other things do in Notion. I, if you're not using databases, you are going to struggle with Notion. So let's create a new database and we'll start it inside gallery view to make it easy. So you're going to do a backslash and type in gallery and you're going to create a gallery database view. I, we're going to do a new data source just to make this simple. So let's just do gallery database as our new database. You're going to click OK. I, you're going to then see that it's a sub item of this page. So you click on gallery database on the left hand side. And now you are inside this gallery database. So what you're going to want to do is you see it's got three pages built in by default. The way to add an image to these pages, I is to click on the page itself, and then it'll, you can either pop it up in this view, or you can do full screen, and then you're going to click on Add Cover. Uh, it's going to pick a random cover by default, so let's just choose whatever the default one is for all three. So let's click on this, Add Cover. Click on this one, Add Cover. If you want to do a different cover, you're just going to click on Change Cover. There is a gallery with all sorts of random stuff in it by default. You can upload your own. You can just get a link off the internet. You can go to Unsplash and search for different things. Like this right here. I you can put whatever you want on there. So you can just type in search for an image. Unsplash is quite good for this kind of stuff. So let's just say we like that one. So you see we still don't have it set up where we can see it. Instead, we're just seeing the contents on, that's on the page. So this these two pages are blank. This one's got some sort of default to-do list. So to finally add the image to the gallery itself. You're going to click over here on not on folder on this. You click on the three dots. You are going to click on layout, and then you're going to see where it says card preview. Instead of page content, you are going to change it to page cover. Now you see it showing up here, and if you go back to your original page, you see your gallery of database has the correct images with the, the name of the page. So there you go. Easy enough. All right. I hope this was useful. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks. Bye.